In the United Arab Emirates, a small green city is being planted in the middle of a big beige desert. Abu Dhabi's Mazdar initiative is attempting to transform this arid site into an oasis of clean energy to build the world's first carbon neutral zero waste urban center, Mazdar City. Abu Dhabi has always been a provider of energy, but they've recognized that in the future, more and more of the energy needs of the world are going to need to be satisfied through renewable energy sources. When the project was announced, many wondered whether this would be little more than a clean energy mirage. After all, oil producer and exporter Abu Dhabi has, per capita, one of the largest carbon footprints in the world. But according to Mazdar's CEO, who has backing from Abu Dhabi's government, an investment of this magnitude makes perfect sense and will only help position Abu Dhabi as a global energy player, even in a post-fossil fuel era. Dr. Sultan al Jaber is putting an emphasis on research and development. You can see it from the neighborhoods being constructed here to a university that's also being built. We've partnered with MIT to help establish a homegrown, graduate-level, research-driven university that is entirely focused and dedicated to renewable energy and sustainability. Expected to open by September 2010, the Mazdar Institute of Science and Technology is meant to act as the magnet that attracts more industry and human capital. So in order for us to develop a city as big and as large as Mazda City, we have to work on energy efficiency. Energy efficiency, as far as Mazda City is concerned, is the name of the game. And that's why you see us adapting, testing, piloting a number of energy efficiency technologies that will help reduce our energy consumption and our energy requirements. Those pilot programs include this central tower beam down project, which is testing concentrated solar power technology. Also on site is a 10 megawatt, 210,000 square meter solar power plant, the largest in the Middle East. Energy collected here is already going into the construction project. As for transportation, while Mazdar City was designed to encourage walking, a personal rapid transit system has been designed so that eventually these driverless pod-like vehicles will be able to take residents anywhere they want to go. Mazdar says these cars won't be powered by gas. A magnetic charge will get them from place to place. The city won't be complete until 2020 at the earliest. And while all involved express nothing but sunny optimism about this project, many hope this green city will not only take root, but that it will also flourish. Mohammed Jamjoum, CNN, Abu Dhabi.